The Bishop of Covington claims an independent investigation into that incident at a Washington, D.C. rally exonerates the Covington High School students involved. Details of that investigation were released today, now nearly a month after a viral video captured a tense encounter between the students and Native Americans. Mike Valenti has more. These were the moments that set social media ablaze last month and sparked outrage across the country. Critics condemned the Covington Catholic students, in particular junior Nick Sandman, for what they viewed as intimidating behavior directed toward a Native American elder, Nathan Phillips. We were surrounded. We couldn't go right, we couldn't go left, back. But in the ensuing days, more videos were released, raising questions about the original narrative. A third-party investigation conducted by an agency retained by the diocese found that some students were performing a tomahawk chop during the incident but it concluded that there was no evidence of offensive or racist statements made to Phillips. The investigation also found that while they were subjected to insults from the group known as the Black Hebrew Israelites, the students never responded in kind. The Bishop of Covington reacting to the investigation's findings today, saying it exonerates the students and that they can move on with their lives. Covering the news, Mike Valenti, LEX 18 News.